Okay. Williams. I work for the Primate and Predator Project as the field team leader. I'm also working on my PhD with Durham University which is on brown hyenas. Um, I mainly do predator research um, and I also supervise the assistance and help with the Earthwatch program here at Majuma. And I'm Sam Williams and I work together with Katie on the Primate and Predator Project. I'm the research coordinator for the Primate and Predator Project so that involves a bit more of the scientific side of things, so planning out the experiments and uh, analysing the data, but also uh, working closely with all the research assistants and the students uh, to make sure that all the research gets done. Okay, hey guys, my name is Rafaela, I'm from Germany and I'm studying in Germany and I'm working on my bachelor thesis on some uncle monkeys here for the Primate and Predator project. Hi guys, I'm Rebecca, I'm from France and I'm already graduated from master degree in biodiversity management and I wanted to come here to have just an amazing experience and behavior of monkeys. Hi, I'm Lee, I'm from the US and I am interning at Lujuma just to get some practical experience in field work working with the primates. Yeah, and um, like I'm uh, in, in general, we're working on uh, first, we're collecting data for the project, which means that we're concentrating on their behavior. We want to find out more about their ecology in general, which means that we're working on phenology and vegetation plots. Yeah. Yeah, as Rafael has said, um, besides the behavior of monkeys, we are also interested more on the vegetation side. So we are focused on trees that the monkeys are feeding on. Yeah. So when they get leaves, when they have fruit on seeds, to relate that, to relate that to their behavior actually. Yeah. Yeah. So we do study the behavior as well. So this week um, we're starting a project to see the response of the mangoes to different colors in the field. So we're gonna be wearing different shirts of red and blue and see how they respond. I'm from England and I'm a zoology undergraduate at Cardiff University. 
Hi, my name is Shannon. I'm from Ireland. I'm also a zoology undergraduate. I study in Liverpool and I'm here in the gym and Queen in my internship. Hi, I'm Tessa. I'm from the US and I'm an undergraduate studying wildlife and conservation biology and I'm also here for an internship for my university. So the majority of our work is focused on maintaining the camera tracking grid on the Juma and the surrounding properties. We have 22 camera stations set up and we hike to them every two weeks to change the data, SD cards and batteries. Um, from these pictures we can analyse the animals which are in the surrounding area, get an indication of their ranges and their activity. Uh, while we hike to these stations, we also collect brown hyena and leopard scats. Um, from these scats, we later analyze them, and from that, we can tell their diets, and we can also get a lot of genetic information from this. Um, in the past two years, we've collared GPS collared um, a lot of animals around Lajuma. We currently have four brown hyenas and three leopards that are collared. Um, using UHF receivers, we can go out and download the GPS points from the collars. And this gives us an indication of their ranging and their territories. Drunk and calling, and I need you.
Caroline, I'm the Primate Research Coordinator here at the Primate and Predator Project and I'm from Northern England. Um, it's my job here to um, coordinate all the vegetation research that we do and also the research on all the monkey species. So that's the burbits, just the mangroves and also the chakma baboons. Uh, we get assistance from all over the world here, come to study at Lajima and it's my job to train them up and send them out into the forests with the monkeys. Um, and I also do quite a lot of monkey following myself, it's specifically with the baboons because they are my favourites. Um, and I know them quite well because I did my master's research on them and they're probably the ones that I resemble the most. Morgan, I come from France and I'm studying baboons. I work a lot with captive animals and I really wanted to see them in the natural environment. And so, yes, we are following baboons uh, from dawn to dusk. And it's really trying sometimes, but they are really fascinating and I love them. I'm Kasim. I'm from Scotland and I follow the baboons with Morgan and Caroline. Outside of here I'm doing a master's on large carnivores. Uh, baboons, we take a lot of data about behavior and what they are eating, in which place they are, which habitat and a lot of things like that. But also about the social interactions while grooming or things like that. And also like encounters for example. Yesterday they killed a red baiter just in front of me, and yeah. <laughs> so we follow the baboons from dusk until dawn. Um, we're at the sleeping sites before the sun comes up, and we're ready for them waking up. And we then stay with them until they go back to bed. Um, we do two types of scans. We do focal scans, where someone will follow one individual baboon and record what they're doing. Um, and we also do scans on the behaviour of as many baboons as we can over a 10 minute period. There's a whisper on the breeze 